Hey guys, how are you doing? In this episode, we are going to see about how to transfer Google Photos to iCloud Photos and how to transfer iCloud Photos to Google Photos. If you are switching to different device, like you are moving from iPhone to Android or Android to iPhone, then you have already used cloud storage services of the respective uh, brand or the product. Like say, for example, if you are an iPhone user and using iCloud Photos all these days and you want to move all your photos and videos backed up to your iCloud to Google Photos, then in this video, we are going to see the step-by-step -step process involved in it. The video is split into two. I'll leave the timeline in the description so first we will see how to move all the photos taken in the Google Photos application or to the Google Photos cloud storage using the Google Takeout to the Apple iCloud Photos. In the second half of the video, we will see the iCloud Photos to Google Photos data migration. Both Apple, Google have come forward to develop this easy transfer options that let customers to easily move the data without much of manual work. So the very first thing we are going to see is how to transfer Google Photos to iCloud Photos. I'll leave the direct link to the Google Takeout link uh, that will select the Google Photos itself by default in the description and in the first comment, I'll pin that so that you can easily click and access it. And the very important thing is do it from a computer browser or you know if you have a tablet or a iPad, you can do this process don't try to do this in mobile phones so you know to avoid any issues in the google takeout link when you click and authenticate with your gmail id and password by default you will see all the photos and albums selected you can click on that link below that google photos logo and you know you can select which albums you want to migrate from you know to transfer from google photos to the icloud photos they have clearly mentioned that this google photos cloud storage transfer for service works with iCloud Photos, Flickr, Microsoft OneDrive and SmugMug. And normally it takes like five to seven days in order to complete this transaction. So if you initiate the transfer completing the step-by-step -step process that we are going to see today, it will take five to seven days. So you need to check your account once again, you know, either the iCloud Photos or the Google Photos to check whether the transfer is completed or not after a week time. So in the first option, you will select the albums uh, that you want to transfer and in the next step, you have to choose which service as the destination one, like you want to move the data to uh, which service. So here I'm selecting the Apple iCloud and it takes me to the appleid.apple.com page where I need to authenticate and select the iCloud Photos section. Very important thing you should remember is make sure to turn off advanced data protection under settings privacy and security in your iPhone or iPad so that this process will work seamlessly. Also, if you have managed Apple ID account like your company provider or organization provider, then this method will not work. The transfer feature is only for individual accounts, so it won't work with any company provider or corporate accounts. You know, they provided the Apple ID, which is managed by them. And for me, after trying the login attempt, you know, my Apple ID uh, was locked. So if you are experiencing similar issue, you need to authenticate with your iPhone or iPad or Mac computer to unlock your Apple ID and approve in the next step to initiate the transfer from Google Photos to iCloud Photos. Here you can see in the next page, once my Apple ID is unlocked, it tells clearly that the permission to add photos to iCloud will be given, both the photos and the videos permission will be given to the Google services so that the transfer can be completed. And below that, they will also display the available storage, the free storage. So if the photos and videos in your Google Photos is higher than the free storage available in your iCloud Photos, make sure to upgrade your iCloud storage plan. Consider iCloud Plus subscription according to the total Google Takeout storage that it is going to take. Then you can seamlessly complete the process of transferring Google Photos to iCloud Photos successfully and now we are in the second part of the video, which is moving iCloud Photos to Google Photos. How to transfer iCloud Photos to Google Photos. Log into privacy.apple.com. I'll also leave this website address in the description and in the first comment. Once you log in with your Apple ID and password, you will be displayed with an options uh, whether you want to move your data to Google Photos or what you have to do with your data and your account. So the very first option you can see, get a copy of your data, whether you 
want to download all the content of your Apple ID, you know, the iCloud associated data to your local computer, you can generate a link there. And then the second option, Apple have recently added this, you can request to transfer a copy of your data to third party cloud storage services, which in this case, the Google Photos, and you can correct your data if there is any data present is wrong. And you can temporarily deactivate your account or delete your account in this page. So here I'm going to select the second option, which is request to transfer a copy of your data. So we are going to transfer the photos and videos uh, by default, you know, it will be selected as the available photos uh, in the iCloud photos and videos section. Then you need to select the destination as Google Photos. And below that, you can choose whether the photos and videos or you can exclude anything if you don't want to transfer it. They also display the available Google account free storage, which makes it easier for us to upgrade the Google storage if we want to move some higher amount of data from iCloud Photos to Google Photo. All right, so here in the next step, you will be asked to enter your authenticate with your Google ID and password. Once done, the transfer will be initiated. So it will take five to seven days, either it is Google service or Apple service in order to complete the Google Photos to iCloud Photos or iCloud Photos to Google Photos transfer process. I hope this video helped you to do the transfer easily when you switch between iPhone or Android device. For WhatsApp regular version of transfer, we can, you know, if you're moving from one platform to, to the other, we can do the free WhatsApp transfer. I leave a link to that video in the description. For WhatsApp business, we need to go for the paid option. For more useful iPhone, iPad and Mac related tips and tricks, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you and have a wonderful day.